So we went to our five-month ultrasound, which is when you kind of find out when you're having a girl, or if you're having a girl or a boy. And they told us that there was something off with her heart. As soon as they made the diagnosis and said, your kids, you know, your child's going to need this open heart surgery right away, they said it was going to be in Edmonton at the Stollery. I don't think there's really much you can do to prepare. And we left there not really knowing what was next. I'd say within the first 24 hours, we were told that she would have her first surgery at six days old. They were super gentle with her. You know, they did everything they could to get us to hold her, which was a big deal because she had so many tubes in the breathing tube in. So they really did everything they could those first six days to make it special for us with, you know, our first baby and a newborn. At 11 months, uh, we found out that she needed to have another heart surgery. She came out of the surgery a lot faster, so I think we were already kind of feeling a little bit more optimistic. When I look at Soria's future, I, you know, sometimes I get scared because of the unknown. The monumentous strides that she's made from, from the first year wondering, what is our life going to look like? I mean, fast forward to now, I, I don't know if I would have imagined that we would have been able to have all these things. No matter where in Alberta a family lives, their child is in need of specialized surgery or organ transplantation. They're coming to the Stollery. You know, Sawyer's um, a journey is just wonderful to, uh, to see. She really epitomizes uh, what the Stollery stands for. The Congenital Hearts um, Surgical Program that uh, is housed here and represents children coming from the Prairie Provinces um, has ch achieved tremendous success over the last three decades. But the space doesn't match the talent. The Stollery is the only children's hospital in Canada that's woven into an adult hospital. The Stollery needs a new home. Why a new children's hospital? As an example, 10 to 20 years ago, she would not have survived. Who is going to be the child 10 to 20 years from now who would not survive if it wasn't for the ongoing expansion and increased capability of a children's hospital. And this is why we always have to shoot for the best. Her cardiologist told us for the first time, like her heart just looks like a normal heart. I never thought I would hear a doctor say your kid's heart looks normal. And I was afraid of, you know, would my child grow up, would she ever go to kindergarten? Would I ever see these moments? But now I'm seeing, I'm seeing all the moments that a parent gets to see with their kid. I'm just super excited to see who she's going to be when she gets to be older and what she chooses to do with her life. All kids in Alberta deserve a better tomorrow. That starts with the things we do today. It's time to build a new home for the Stollery. For kids like Sawyer, for tomorrow, and today.